Hi, today I'd like to explain on how we successfully serve legal documents filed in the United States to Switzerland. This case stems out of a Louisiana in the United States District Court. The defendant was a corporation and it involved a personal injury matter involving a maritime law. Now we successfully served in Switzerland using the Hague Convention and the USM 94. We prepared the USM 94 not only in English, but also in German. When you're serving in Switzerland, there are three languages they speak. They speak German, Italian, and French. And depending on the region where you're serving, that dictates what language you're going to be translating your documents into. Once the translation is completed, then everything is packaged and sent to the central authority in Switzerland with the appropriate number of copies, the cover letter, and the documentation. Once it's received at the central authority, then it is served. In this particular case, it took one month to serve the defendant, and it took three weeks for them to actually prepare the affidavit. And then a few days after that, they actually mailed us the affidavit of service, and we received it by mail. Now, what's interesting about this case is that we got different documentation that proves that the actual service was conducted. And these are all things that will be filed with the court. We received this cover letter. As you can see, and it's addressed to the attorney. It's signed um, and it actually has the seal as well. So it's a cover letter enclosing the certificate. We also received this page which shows us that the actual employee of the corporation received the documentation. And then we received the certificate. And the certificate they use is the one that comes out of the USM 94. And this is a certificate of service. And it tells us when it was served, at the location it was served, who signed for it, the employee's information, and then it's signed and sealed and dated at the bottom as you can see there. Then they also return the USM 94 that was sent, and here it has the actual stamp as to when they received the application. So all of these documents are actually sent to the attorney and then filed with the court. And this was the actual translation that we did here in-house. And it also has the stamp as to when they received it, and it has the certificate of translation that must accompany the translation that certifies that the translation is being done professionally. All of these documents came back to us in a regular envelope, not registered or FedEx. We received all this and now we're going to package it, send it to the attorney of record so that he or she can file it with their court. If you need international service of process, please always keep us in mind because we get it done. Thank you.